Just a few hours ago, Skip Bayless confirmed the rumors and reports that have been circulating for the past month that he's done at Fox Sports 1, that after eight years on Undisputed and followed a very bitter and strange split between him and Shannon Sharp, who went on to go to first take at ESPN, and who honestly, even though the ratings for ESPN aren't nearly where they used to be or where they probably should be, you know, Stephen A. Smith has been dominating him in the ratings. First take has been dominating Undisputed, and it hasn't even been close. Well, he finally made it official. He's done. He's leaving. But the strangest part was there was no goodbye. There was no acknowledgement that this was it. Simply a tweet from Skip Bayless. If you'd watched Undisputed, you'd have no idea that this was the last time he was actually going to address that fan base. Skip Bayless confirms Fox Sports 1 departure after eight years. Teases, quote, other opportunities. Skip Bayless says goodbye to Fox Sports, announcing today was his last day as host of Undisputed after eight years with FS1. But it was just this, right? As soon as it went off air, as soon as Undisputed went off air, Skip Bayless tweets this. Today was my last show on Undisputed. I'm leaving FS1. I've been planning to pursue other opportunities for several months. I had a great eight-year run with a lot of great people at Fox, but now I'm excited for what's coming up. Stay tuned. Now, what does that mean? Does that mean another network? Does that mean he's really focusing on his own stuff, a podcast that a lot of people are obviously doing that right now anyway? Who knows? But look at the time on that. 12.01, a minute after Undisputed went off air. And there was, that's the strangest thing. There's no goodbye at all. Shockingly, Bayless was given no on-air send-off on Undisputed. He went out talking with a close personal friend, Lil Wayne, Paul Pierce, and Keyshawn Johnson, talking about the mythical battle between the Dream Team and the current Olympic roster. Not once on Undisputed was Bayless's future or a goodbye mentioned. After so many years at the network and the high-profile shift from ESPN to FS1, it's strange there was no celebration of his time at the network or acknowledgement of his departure. By comparison, when Shannon Sharp left the program, just, you know, almost a year ago at this point probably, it's hard to remember when some of these things take place, whether it's several months, whether it's a year, but... Shannon Sharp left the program after friction with his colleague to move to ESPN. He was given an on-air send-off. Was this a Bayless decision, an FS1 decision, or both? Definitely strange and definitely the end of an era, but I'm not exactly sure too many people are going to miss it at this point. Uh, I've stated for a while that I kind of think that, that that method, these fake, phony debate shows... I really think people are moving away from that. That's why ESPN went out and got a guy like Pat McAfee, right? Because that that's not what they do. That seemed to be the direction so many audience members were looking for, so they went out and gave Pat McAfee a fuck ton of money. And like I said, even though Stephen A. Smith and Shannon Sharp's first take dominated Undisputed, it's still not anywhere near the type of ratings that these things, that these shows were getting years ago. But it is an end of an era to be sure. What do you guys think about Skip Bayless officially leaving? Let me know in the comments section below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later.